Hey guys, I'm Matt Schweitzer, Vice President of Culinary for Hop Dowdy Burger Bar. Today we're in the heart of the hill country. We're spending some time at Rome Ranch and talking with our new partners about their bison. Force of Nature is an industry leader in regenerative farming. Regenerative meat means that the meat that you're consuming is having a positive impact on the environment. Their farmers both humanely raise one of the most storied herds of ruminant animals in North America while restoring the grasslands and the ecosystem that their bison graze on. When we first bought the property, about 50% of it was literally bare soil, and we had about half a percentage of organic matter on this property. That basically means we were on dead land, and so it was our goal to bring that land back to life. At Force of Nature, these guys aren't just raising bison. They're creating a biodiverse farm that goes well beyond organic. So instead of mechanical inputs, synthetic pesticides, and human disturbance, they believe in having a variety of wildlife that naturally and sustainably tends to the land as Mother Nature intended. We want to see biodiversity above ground, below ground, within the animal species that we have, within our business model. Diversity is critical to resilience. A common misconception is that all bison is 100% grass fed their entire life, and that's just not the case. Most are actually finished with corn, grains, or soy. However, a core tenant of regenerative farming is growing all of the food these animals eat on the land that they're raised, which means these animals are grass fed and grass finished their entire life. When you're grass feeding and finishing animals, you're really a grass farmer first. If you're a grass farmer, you want to have healthy, green growing grass year round. And to do that, you move these animals in and they take a bite. They deposit their nutrients and then they leave. Now conventionally, they would stay in that area and as that grass tries to regrow, all that energy stored up in the roots to try to regrow the grass, when they take that second bite, they kill the grass. It has no ability to continue to grow and use those nutrients for good. We're replicating the predator-prey relationship, so as human managers, we are constantly keeping the animals going. So the way that these bison are raised lends itself to a really interesting health and flavor profile. From a health perspective, there's a really high concentration of omega-3 fats, which are known to be heart healthy. From a macronutrient profile, they're actually denser in B vitamins, copper, potassium, and zinc. So the end result of grass-fed, grass-finished bison is debatably the most nutrient-dense food known to man. We created this brand because we wanted to have an impact on the environment and human health. But like the impact that Pop Daddy can have by partnering with us is just so enormous. For every burger that you guys sell, like there's a true impact on the land. When you're collaborating and you're working within Mother Nature's image, you are capturing more carbon than you're off-putting. You're combating climate change by eating a burger off of a regenerative ranch. 